Hello and welcome. We're at AFA's Airspace and Cyber Conference with Northrop Grumman's Wade Griswold, Director of Strategy and Business Development for Missile Products, Propulsion Systems, and Controls. Thanks, Wade, for being with us and uh, talking a little bit about advanced propulsion. Yep, thanks, Barry, and great to be here at AFA. Uh, and love to talk more about you about our hypersonic missile propulsion activities. Great, so the first question is about the threat scenario. So what is the challenge that the DOD and its partner nations are facing when it comes to hypersonics? So when DOD and the US Air Force are analyzing the pacing threat, um, a hypersonic missile propulsion capability for their offensive mission set is a, is a must-have capability. Mm -hmm. And the, the true intent is to address high-value targets in a time-sensitive uh, nature, mm -hmm. uh, and so missiles that are faster, more survivable, and highly maneuverable is what the US Air Force is trying to get after. And so that's where our scramjet technology is being leveraged uh, for Air Force solutions. Very good. So what is it that Northrop Grumman is doing uh, for its programs in hypersonics? What's new and interesting? Yep. And maybe what are some of the, the milestones that you have coming up in the next year? Yes, uh, that's an excellent question. Uh, so in, in September of last year, uh, the US Air Force awarded a contract to our prime partner Raytheon for the HACM program, the hypersonic cruise missile. So we're leveraging um, our scramjet tech our scramjet technology for that solution, mm -hmm. and that, like I talked about, enabling and getting that those requirements, or to the requirements that the Air Force is trying to set. Right. Uh, so, in in the end state, uh, the intent is to mature those designs and then deliver operational prototypes uh, by the end of the contract. Oh, very good. And so, what is it that Northrop is doing? in the area of infrastructure and capacity to build these systems affordably and at scale. Uh, in July, we had our Hypersonic Capability Center grand opening in Elton, Maryland. Mm -hmm. Great event, had a lot of support from the Maryland state officials, uh, DOD officials, the US Air Force uh, program team was there all celebrating the grand opening. And that was an investment by Northrop Grumman to uh, stand up that facility so that when the Air Force is ready to increase production, then we can do it affordably right. and at the rate that the Air Force needs going forward. So uh, that was a vision on our part, us and Northrop Grumman, to recognize a need uh, that was coming mm -hmm. and then our investment to put that in place. Great, good stuff, Wade. Thanks yeah. for taking some time to chat with us and thanks to our viewers for watching. Bye.